Morning guys, Saturday morning, just gone quarter to six and we're off for a swim, or a taper swim in fact, because you know what, tomorrow is race day, again. So here we go guys, swim all done, uh, 2,300 meters, get the taper swim, nice and easy actually. So I mentioned the triathlon tomorrow. And that is the Ardenley Triathlon over in East Sussex. So I'm gonna head out there today actually. Head out there this morning, get home, pack the car up and book to Premier Inn. Just because it's gonna be an early one. I think it's a 7 a.m. start. I thought, mm, let's get a, get a hotel, get an extra hour in bed at least. So that's the plan. I'm gonna head home, get everything ready and head up there. Spend the day in Brighton. Looks like we're going to have a nice weekend. It's been a nice week off actually from school and work. Felt like actually it's done some, some nice things. So let's get on with it. And then tomorrow is what? Your triathlon. Yeah, that's right. Do we have to watch it? Uh, Do yes. mornings just gone five o'clock heading down to the car heading to the venue let's get a race on it's actually a really pleasant morning still getting used to this getting up getting out early and being light it's nice oh that reminds me i've got to pay for the car let's turn some lights on hopefully you can see me so we're in the car ready to go. The venue is about 10 minutes away, so I'm gonna leave in just a, a few minutes. Uh, Kate and Isabel are with me, but they're obviously not with me this early. I wouldn't dare drag, drag them out at uh, 
you know, five o'clock, particularly when they've got the hotel and they've got breakfast to look forward to. But they'll be joining me at some point this morning, probably as I'm finishing the bike on the run. So hopefully you should be able to get some uh, footage for me of the race. Uh, race is due to kick off at seven. It's a bit, bit short cutting it for time if you ask me considering you know they want you to register at 10 past six set up and get in the water by seven which is 50 minutes so we'll see how that pans out i'm not sure whether they're just saying that and it will be a half seven start but we'll see when we get there um like i said it's only 10 minutes away parking doesn't open till half five so yeah um we'll see how we get on i'll try and capture as much as i can at the venue but it might be a bit of a rush getting everything done we'll see how we go so when i said it was lumpy this is a very steep hill i think we've got to climb up and come down <laughs> i think i'm over the The new triathlon done. I've got to say, it wasn't my best performance, I don't think. Not my type of course. I'll give the rundown when I get home, but oh, tough going out there. Good swim, lumpy bike, and a cross country run, which is not my cup of tea. Up, 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 and down, down, down. But I'll go with the run through when I get home. Hey everyone, so this isn't after the race, this is actually a good couple of days after it. And you might hear that I've had a bit of a cold, still suffering with a blocked up nose, but I actually feel alright. Uh, looking back on it, I've had a bit of time to reflect. It wasn't that bad a performance really. I finished fourth in my age group, I think I was 20th overall, so I'm happy with that. I'll take that on a course I've never really sort of uh, tried before. Uh, like I said on the race day video, I was really happy with my swim. The swim was lovely in the reservoir, really nice temperature. Uh, bike was okay really considering how lumpy it was but the run just yeah let me down and that was mainly to do with a really bad stitch that I had uh, I think I took too much water on at the end of the bike course there were no run feed stations meaning no water or anything like that so I was a little bit apprehensive so uh, it was quite warm so I decided to take on some extra fluid uh, just at the end of the end of the bike and I think it was just too much it's all sloshing around in my stomach and the run course really didn't suit me. It was, like I said, a cross-country trail type run uh, through fields, little tracks, trails, bits of it still pretty wet, through forest. Uh, and it was up, 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 and then down, down, down. And it was two laps of that. And the stitch really was with me probably for the first three quarters of the first lap. So I managed to overcome that. And when I did overcome it, I was actually running pretty well. But those sorts of runs don't suit me. I find it really hard to get into a rhythm. Um, sometimes I think I'm quicker walking up a really steep hill than I'm, I'm trying to run it. But overall, uh, relatively pretty pleased. I will probably follow up with a race report during the week, looking at my individual splits and that kind of thing, like I did after the last uh, Dawny Sprint Triathlon. But I'm going to leave this video here. If you're new around here, do hit the sub button. It does mean a lot. And I will see you probably in the week. Mm -hmm.